Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and his coalition celebrated Donald Trump's election victory, with Netanyahu calling it history's greatest comeback. He welcomed Trump's return as a new chapter for the U.S.-Israel alliance, especially on issues critical to Israel's security. Leaders of Israel's settler movement said they expected Trump to be an unconditional ally. Hamas, meanwhile, her urged Trump to move away from blind support for Israel, reflecting ongoing tensions in the region. In a move tied to his coalition's priorities, Netanyahu dismissed Defense Minister Yov Gallant, a trust figure in Biden's administration, replacing him with Israel Katz. Kurtz noted that Trump's win might bolster Israel's strategy to bring hostages home from Gaza. Under Trump's first term, Israel gained U.S. recognition of Jerusalem as its capital and control over the Golan Heights. And many Israelis now believe Trump's new term will continue that support. A survey by the Israel Democracy Institute indicated that nearly two-thirds of Israelis view Trump as more favorable to their country than his Democratic rival Kamala Harris.